To create this design, you need to add a torus. And I will go with a 24 major segment and 12 minor segment. Then go to the edit mode. Select these faces. And delete these faces. Take the symmetry. Then select these edges. And then E to extrude them and move them along the normal Y axis. Like this. Then select everything. Mesh and symmetrize. Take the symmetry. Then select this edge loop and press F to fill the gap. Then select everything, mesh and symmetrize, take the symmetry along the Z axis. Then use the knife tool and create cut along the X axis. Then select these faces and delete them. Then select this edge loop and press F to fill the gap. Then take the symmetry, add one word here. Select these words and press J to connect them. Then use the knife tool and create this kind of cut. And then create one cut here. Then add one loop cut here. And select these words and press J to connect them. Then select this edge loop. Then select this edge loop and Ctrl B add bevel on it. Add a two segment bevel and shape factor should be one. Select these words and then merge them at last. Then dissolve these edges. Select these words and merge them at the center. In this way. Select this word and merge at here. Then hit the control tool and add the sub D modifier. And share smooth it. Uncheck this option. And the topology is like this. This loop structure. We can dissolve these edges. And you can create this kind of cut. Mesh symmetrize with the symmetry. Let's see. We will get this kind of loop structure. Then select this edge loop and press Alt S to scale them along the normal. Select this edge loop and Ctrl B add bevel on it. And then select this edge loop and use the set flow on them. Add loop cuts here. Select this edge loop and press F to fill the gap. Then use the insert operation. And use the insert operation one more time. Select this edge loop. And Ctrl B add bevel on it. Add one segment bevel. Then select this edge loops and Ctrl B add bevel on them. Now select this edge loop. You can use the loop tool circle option and you can create circular design and extrude it along the Z axis in this way. Then select this edge loops and Ctrl B add bevel on them. Then use the insert operation, delete the face, select this edge loop and then go to the face and grid fill. And then adjust offset. Turn on the simple blending. And you can see the design. You can see the form. You can see the topology. So that's it for today. Thanks for watching. If you like this tutorial. Then hit that like button. And subscribe to the channel. Bye bye. See you next video. Take care.